Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, I did some damage today. I went out shopping. Recently, I've been trying to not shop as much or spend less money. But since my birthday and Actually, the start of this year, I've been spending a lot less money. I've been trying to save up. I've been trying to do many things, kind of like, you know, to save a lot of more money. And today, I decided to do some damage and treat myself. Since for my birthday, I actually didn't really do anything. And I didn't really get myself anything or ask anyone for anything at all to be honest so I decided okay um, since I'm running out of my skincare products uh, I will go out and actually buy some stuff as you may have seen on the photos I have quite a lot of bags and in those bags I have a quite a lot of stuff but I w will actually give you an introduction well not really an introduction what am I saying? Um, basically, I want to show you guys the products that I actually bought and also actually the products that I actually just finished and why I, re I am rebuying it. There is still some stuff that hasn't arrived that I bought that I've already finished that we'll show you guys now. Uh, I will get them around the beginning of next month. So hopefully, hopefully, this is just some of the stuff that I use on my daily skincare and all of that uh, have some fashion products and have some hair care products that I'm wanting to try out and also don't really have a lot of makeup currently these days I've been into skincare more than makeup since I every time I have to go to work I have to wear makeup and we always because now of covid and also here in thailand bangkok has a lot of pm 2.5 we have to wear masks all the time um even during work so basically i'm wearing makeup underneath that mask and i tend to like i have very sensitive skin so i tend to break out a couple of bits Style. i kind of break out a couple of times and also sometimes i get like kind of like little small allergy dots on my skin as well so i decided to basically nowadays try to wear less foundation i tend to use concealer or either kind of like um the cushion yeah the cushion compact um that i've got from the last from the haul that i did like months ago I still am using those and I find that they are really light on my skin um, yeah they don't make my skin very dry out so I will show you the products that I've just finished and why do I recommend it for you guys and then we'll get onto the haul which is right next to me and then yeah let's get started shall we okay so the first products that i have actually finished actually there's three products that i finished um the two products that i really highly recommend are these two this is from misha is their time revolution artemisa treatment essence and uh, input so basically i finished this big bottle and it lasted me about since the day I actually did the haul video, which is probably about about almost one year or six to eight months around that time. And I just finished the big bottle and I also finished the impulse. I still have the, sam the medium sized bottle that they gave to me as, a, as an extra gift when I, uh, when I bought it last time. So yeah. I really love it it makes my skin very moisturized and it doesn't break me out and to people who have really really sensitive skin I do really recommend it if you guys are looking for something that 
um, is moisturizing it doesn't break you out and it doesn't really kind of like irritates your skin it's very this there's no scent to it um, one of my friends who come and sleep over she actually has an acne porn skin and she loves this she said it's very moisturizing it's very calm and cooling and it didn't break her out or anything and most of the products um, it did break her out so she really really likes this so yeah I've actually bought this this and this I bought online already and ha it's not arrived yet maybe arrived in March the 3rd or so as it says that it will be delivered during that time so yeah and today I went shopping and I found the shop Misha shop here in Thailand which I didn't know about because I normally f shop in kind of like a multi beauty beauty shop where it has a lot of different types of Korean stuff Korean skincare and all of that but yeah I do really recommend this if you do shop and you're looking for online wherever you are uh, and looking for a good skincare product that you find that you want something that it's not breakable not doesn't irritate your skin I do recommend this brand I've tried their time revolution the normal one before and it that did break me out but this one is actually really really good for people with sensitive skin so it's really good in trying it out and the quality is very good like if you listen to that it's a glass bottle so yes and also the impulse is very very good as well I, I sometimes don't use the combo together sometimes I do sometimes I don't it really depends on um, what my skin really needs on that day I have different um, essence and serums and ampoules and all that that I will show you guys also like the refills that I have and in how I use them and all that in the next video I will show you all my skincare products what I actually use what I've been using for a very long time as well like my skincare I used to try out different products a lot of a lot of different products but that kind of damaged my skill and breaking it up a lot and I was breaking out a lot so I decided to try certain products and those didn't break me out so I keep buying those products so this is from my experience every skin top is different and also your everybody's skin is very different even though people may say oh you have combination skin you have dry skin you have oily skin but there are certain ingredients in the different skin types that you have that your skin cannot handle so yeah so a lot of skincare that I've used before and do break me out and people who've used also who's also a combination skin and doesn't break out it really depends on the ingredients that it's used in the skincare so I do recommend to when you're trying out skincare to try it for a long time and see how it goes if it does break you out stop using it give it to someone else or give it to your family you know that okay maybe have the same type of skin or doesn't let them try it out if it still doesn't work you know but I do suggest that try something out first and if it does break you out stop and try a different solution and this and make sure you see what kind of ingredients that that skincare has that broke you out basically and then you if you find another skincare product you want to try you can look at that the area where it says the ingredients and then if they do have that ingredient in it don't use it you know but it's different for everyone, different skincare is different for everyone but for me I find that certain skincare for me if they have certain ingredients that I've used before or I've had creams or anything like that has the same ingredient in every one it tends to break you out but yeah so the next finished product I've used this a lot like really I show you guys this one I've used this a lot. I think this would be probably be my fifth finished bottle since I've discovered this. I've 
used this quite a lot. It's their freshly juiced vitamin drop from Dear Claire's. And I use this only during at night time, especially when my skin looks quite dull. For example, like I don't use this every day. I I used to use this every day before when I like basically my skin really needed like to get rid of dark the dark spots and stuff that I had from my acne. But now I kind of don't use it every day. I use it only when I feel like my skin looks dull and looks on like kind of healthy and it's a boost of vitamin C and also like especially if like I had a breakout and it actually just you know left me a scar and stuff I do use this as well I only use this at night because the reason why I only use this guy at night time is because it's vitamin C and it's also um, once it's vitamin C and if you wear it during the day, you need to put a lot of more sunscreen onto your face because vitamin C kind of like when it gets contact with the sun, you know, it's an acid. So it can actually make your skin a lot darker and it kind of affects like that. So it does, it's meant to brighten up your face. So, and it's pure vitamin C. So I do suggest that, that you actually take do this at night time and it helps a lot because you, your skin starts to rejuvenate during night time when you rest. So this is very concentrated. So I do suggest to like, you know, wear it at night time. And yeah, now this, I have not finished these products, but there is a few products that I do recommend. Um, if you get the chance of using, if you are looking for a toner or a toner plus essence, I do recommend this guy. This is the Sun and Park Beauty Water. I actually went to buy this, a new bottle of this today, but they don't have a big bottle of this. They don't have this big bottle. They only have the sample size bottles. So I got a new product, which is from this brand, which is a gel. So I want to try that out. But I am planning to repurchase this guy again, probably in Lazada because I think they will have it. Website, they have everything. So I really, really love this toner essence kind of thing. So it's a, it is a smart cleansing based on natural plant therapy. It helps exfoliate and moisturize the skin. So once you wash your face, and you know, most of us we don't wash our face that clean so this is actually very helpful as well I do tend to use this also as a toner itself or an essence because it just boosts up the skincare the first step of your when you start your skincare so I do really really recommend this if you guys can see that so it's Sun and Park and it is the beauty water and okay, so, so I think we should start with the skincare since we just talked about skincare. So the first one is from Misha. Misha. As I said, I figured out there is actually a Misha shop here in Bangkok. And but I was too late. I already bought the essence and ampoule on the website. And it's shipping from Korea, so yeah. So Misha store has a buy one get one free. Buy one get one free. So basically I got the cream. I got the Time Revolution Artemisa Calming Moisturizing Cream. And I got the same one, the same size, the same price for free. This retails here in Thailand for sorry, uh, for four four for two thousand four hundred and ninety baht per box. So yeah, uh, once you open the box, you have the cream, and also comes with a spatula. So this is the size of the cream. So it's a 50 ml size cream once you open it. So this is the consistency of the cream. It's very light, it's gel-like type. It's very light and it's not very sticky, which 
I really like kind of that, those kind of creams. But it's a calming moisturizing cream. I'm very into calming creams these days because my skin, since you know we wear ma I wear masks a lot and also do makeup a lot, my skin gets irritated a lot. So calming things are very very good for combination skin or skin that ir get are sensitive or gets irritated quite easily. So yes. This cream is a highly concentrated common cream. It's formulated with double fermented Artemisa annua extracted from Guanghua Island, an island with a mild climate that lies in the West Sea of Korea West Coast. So it helps fortify skin moisture barrier that helps relieve fat tissue and dry skin to keep the complex look more comfortable. I use this day and night but I don't use it every day. I do have different moisturizers that I use depending on my skin when at nighttime and also at daytime. I tend to try not to use the same thing every day. Well, I use all, like, I don't use the same type of products every day in a sense, but kind of like I mix and match everything. It depends on how my skin is like when i take off my makeup i leave my uh when i take off my makeup with the makeup remover right i don't immediately go wash my face and all of that i kind of just give my skin time a bit to kind of relax from taking off the makeup and then uh after that once i relax probably five minutes and let my skin kind of breathe a little bit I then go take a shower wash my face after I wash my face I immediately I will know if my face is getting dry very fast or what my skin really needs so after I take a shower wash my face and everything once I pat my face dry if my face is kind of like it feels dry feels tight that's when i feel like okay today i really need to moisture my skin and kind of like add extra moisture into my skin and maybe add a little bit of vitamin c as well to just kind of keep my face a little bit more kind of like refresh so when i wake up in the morning i don't look so dull uh also for me from experience like how my skin reacts to different products and stuff like that and also how my skin looks on a day-to-day -day basis I tend to know what I actually need on that night so for example if today I take off my makeup and I feel like okay my skin looks really really dull it really needs a, like a plump up I will add the vitamin C I will add kind of like more calming my skin kind of gets irritated or if I have redness or something like that you know it goes it goes like that that's how I tend to choose what skincare I use per, in a day so yeah so the next product I got in Misha is actually an eye cream I, I'm looking for a really really good eye cream and so Misha has like a promotion one buy one get one free so I decided to get the Misha the, the Misha Guam Sol vitalizing eye cream so this is the packaging, it's in a gold packaging, and they had two different eye creams. One of them is, l the ingredients is less, and it's for kind of like, you know, younger generation, younger people. I'm now 26 years old, so basically, I want to take care of my skin more. Uh, so yeah, I decided to get this one. It's smaller packaging compared to the other one, but it's more has more concentrated ingredients in this one this retails for in Thai baht is 2590 baht so this retails for 71 euros and 46 cents and us would be 86 us dollars and 64 cents and korea is 65,531 won but Korean price I'm not really 100% sure you will need to look it up in a Korean website but yes so this is the packaging 
once you open up you get a spoon and this is the packaging the packaging is so pretty so the gold packaging it has a really cute design on top as well and yeah so they say this is actually a more concentrated formula so I've never used this brand eye cream before yeah so this is the consistency of the cream is quite thick it's really really thick the eye cream that I'm using currently I don't use it every day but it's the Tatcha eye cream and I find like that's quite good but I feel like it doesn't really do do my eye as much justice or I'm not using it every day enough but yeah um, I'm been getting quite a lot of dark circles because I'm sleeping quite late and also that um, a lot of stress as well so you know my under eyes aren't doing that great at the moment I don't really have much wrinkles it's just they're getting dark and my eye bags are starting to get like quite deep so yes so that's what I got on Misha next um, I'll probably go with still Korean products so it's a lot easier to explain next is from this store called multi beauty so I bought a lot of my skincare in multi beauty because they mostly have all of my skincare that I actually need it so I'll show you guys the freebies first what I got for, what I got for free because I spent quite a lot there today so yeah they gave me kind of like a makeup bag in a green color for the serum that I got so, this is cute and then I got some stickers for free from Cosrx. I got samples from Banana Boat Sunscreen. I got three of these, four of these, and then I got uh, make brushes as a free gift. Uh, I got a mirror as a free gift. What else did I get? And I also got a photo card of Kim So Hyun. The first product that I got is the Beauty Gel by Sun and Park. So as I told you, they didn't have the beauty water. They only had the beauty gel in the big size. So I decided to get the try the beauty and gel. And I ordered this online. Anywho, anyhow, getting back to this new product that I'm gonna be trying. So the Sun and Park Beauty and Gel, the skincare makeup booster at once. So it's a moisturizing gel which is con Constantly refreshing oxygen gel and collagen capsule filled with rose oil combined to create skin smooth skin. So the ingredients they have is the chok chok. <laughs> chok chok in Korean is like bouncy oxygen gel, a burst of oxygen hydration, renovated skin and boost immune. And the tok 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 is the collagen capsule, ice and rose oil capsule minimize the appearance of pores and create a smooth complexion so how to use this is basically tap the skin gently with fingers and attractivate capsules and enhance the observation so basically just use it as a moisturizer so dun -dun -dun. I love how their packaging is very very minimal so this is the beauty gel that it comes in as you guys can see and this is how many ml this is 330 ml so this actually lasts me a long time so does the ball beauty water the beauty water actually lasts you a really really long time as well and this is 340 so this has a lot more than this yeah the size is a little bit different okay so at the back it says it's clinically approved to improve pores and reduce the temperature of the skin uh, it cools down the temperature of the skin and it makes it glow as as minimized as pores so this is really good for calming your skin anything that's calming is very good do you see the little dots in that yeah that's the what is it the tok tok collagen capsule so I can't wait to to actually try this 
and on my next video I will give you a review on it. Yeah. So moving on. Sorry if I'm gonna starting to speak faster. I don't want to make this video really really long for you guys because it gets boring. So as you guys know, I do use the Cosar X pads, and this one is the clear pad. This is the original one. So I have not much to say about this, but it's the bomb diggity. I just it's really good, especially when I already finished bottle uh bottle it's not even a bottle a container of this already so i do really it's a 70 pads it has 70 pads inside sorry i kind of like lost for words there it has 70 pads in this and it should be used to clean your face and your neck uh you could use it once or twice a day so this has these are all the ingredients that is oops, I don't know if you can see that so they have the ingredients like written here as well what they contain so I got the original pad and it's really really good for people with oily skin combination skin um, but Cosrx also have different categories. There's the moisturizing one, which is good for dry skin when add moisture, and then there's a calming one. I also wanted to try the calming one, so I got the calming one. So this is the uh, Green Hero Calming Pad, One Step Cosrx pads as well. So basically, okay. So yeah, these are the calming pads. And they're in green. The moisturizing one is in blue. So I wanted to try it out, especially on days that I really need extra calming. So I got the calming pad as well. It has all the ingredients that are written on the container here as well. It comes in seven with 70 pads. And yeah. Okay, next product is the Dear Claire's Midnight Blue Calming Cream. So I will rave about this and I will rave about this again. On the last haul, I got the big one, but unfortunately, the shop, the multi beauty, they don't have the big size, so I got this the small size that they actually came out with in the beginning, which is 30 ml. They don't have the 60 ml, and my 60 ml is almost running out. So, this is a really good cream as well, a really good calming cream. I suggest if you do like calming creams to get this one. It comes in a container like this. It's not plastic. And once you open it, the cream is quite thick, so you only need a little bit. So it's a blue kind of cream, like its name, Midnight Blue. And it refreshes your face a lot. And it comes also with a spatula as well. I use this mostly during the night time, but if I feel like once, if I already use it at night time and during the day my skin feels still feels irritated, I will use it again before I put my makeup on. So I do really recommend this as well. Next product is the Dear Claire's Rich Moist Soothing Serum. So this is a soothing serum and my other my old haul that I did that I got stuff from Korea you guys know that I also got this guy as well because as you as I told you I use the same skincare products that have not broken me out many times and I will continue buying it because it's what we it's what good for your skin so this is the bottle and it is a 2.7 ounces soothing serum so it's like a pump serum here so I tend to use this with the vitamin C also to combine together if I don't want the vitamin C to be so concentrated and yeah so I do recommend this for moisture, anyone with dry skin or combination skin or would just need a little bit of more moisture in their life. Okay, 
um, the next products you guys will know it is the Dear Claire's Vitamin C so it comes a container like this the pure vitamin C and they say not to leave this in the sun because if you do it will turn yellow so look so over oh, over the time there's a little bit of serum left at the bottom if it gets into contact with sun it turns yellow the color will change from um, a clear a clear white to kind of a yellow as you can see that like the difference in the you know also this is quite old but yeah that's why I tell you guys if you do get this use it only during your nighttime routine because it's a lot more safer simple but enough I don't know if you can see that but, yeah. next two products I got is I forgot to tell you the prices damn it okay so This guy retails for 623 baht. Okay. 623 baht. It is 17 euros. And then the Causer X actually was on sale and it cost 529 baht which is 14 14 euros and 59 cents for both of them and then we have the clears midnight cream which was 749 baht which was 20 euros and 66 cents and then we have the mid then we have the soothing serum which is 800 baht which is 22 euros and 7 cents and then we have the vitamin c which is 790 baht which is 29 euro 21 euros and 79 cents now moving on Sorry guys. Uh, is the central calming shot? The central calming shot is one of the products that I actually got introduced to the last time of last last haul. So this was one of their new products that just came out in Korea when I bought it the last time, but now it's here in Thailand, so I got a refill of I've not a refill but a new bottle of it. It is the Amplion Central Calming Shot and Pro. Uh, this is really good. It really calms your skin. Love it. And this retails for 712 baht, which is 19 euros and 64 cents. The next one is the 20k Gold Shot Emperor. This is also an emperor that I really, really love using. Get rid of your wrinkles and everything. And this is the container. Can you see the gold flakes? And actually, this retails for 690 baht, which is 19 euros and 3 cents. It's cheaper than the common one. The next thing that I got is for your body is a 365 body spa treatment and it comes with a bath towel so this is actually meant to clean away all your dead skin and stuff like that that cream people like use to scrub their skin there's a spa that you can scrub your skin with and this retails for 390 baht which is actually 10 euros and 76 cents and it comes with a glove like a glove towel so yeah i'm excited to be using this I can't wait to review it for you guys and see how my skin actually feels with this. So yes. Random thing that I got is Jungkook's toothbrush. 
So this was advertised with Jungkook's face on it and from BTS and I had to get it because I'm a major Jungkook fan. If you guys don't know who Jungkook is, search BTS and then look up the members. And this retails for 89 baht which is 2.45 euros. For so yes, I don't know if in it if in Ireland or in European countries it's expensive for a toothbrush but here in Thailand it's actually quite pricey for a toothbrush you can get it like a cheap toothbrush for like 10 for like 24 baht 50 baht or something like that but since it's for Jungkook <sighs> yes Jungkook the next thing is for my hair so I really really love this this is the not this one <laughs> I really really love this one this one is the premium total hair detox so I love this because my hair was thinning quite a lot and this kind of helped me kind of like renew my scalp a lot as well to clean my scalp and everything like that so um, this is an anti hair loss kind of care so yeah since you stress a lot or you kind of like get not enough rest your hair kind of suffers as well so i got a new bottle of this because i ran out of it well, i didn't run out it's almost running out almost running out and this retails for how much does it retail for this retails for 479 baht which is 13 euros and 21 cents or $16 for this one the same goes with this one so this is the new one for me so this one is the voluming hair to tonic so this is a hair to hair loss well, an anti hair loss care as well so this is a spray type spray type hair tonic that can manage scalp and hair so this guy basically is when you spray it on your hair is meant to volumize your hair at the same time so, yeah so the first step is to shake the bottle then spray it onto your the top of your head and then you kind of like mush it up and then it gives you volume okay. so it comes in a bottle like this and it's purple purple is so cute so yes so I can't wait to try this out since I've cut my hair quite short my hair is quite flat at the bottom so I needed to get something to volumize my hair and that's all of that from this bag so let's move on to the next product shall we so yes, the next product, since we're still talking about skincare and hair care and all of that, let's talk about Sephora. So, Sephora, what did I get in Sephora? Sephora, I got a lot of things that I wanted to try out. So Sephora is actually my experimental, um, what you call it, products that I want to try out. So the first thing that I got is a wet hair is prone to damage how to dry it matters a rapid dry hair turban. So I got this guy here in this blue greenish color. So the lady told me that if I was going to wash this um I wash it with just cold water, not hot water. I'm just like, okay. That's no problem. And actually this, the waffle towel, is actually called waffle towel? I did not. Okay, the waffle towel. The waffle towel cost, uh, from Sephora, everything is pricey, so please don't judge me. Uh, so the waffle towel is 1,550 baht, which is 42 euros and 75 cents for just this. I could actually order it online and got a cheap one, but... I, from my logic, if I buy a cheap one, I don't think it will work. 
as well as to get a reasonable price for it. And the next thing that I got is the NARS concealer in medium custard. My concealer color. I don't know if you guys can see that. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, I needed to get a new one because my old one was about to finish. And this retails floor, floor, floor. One thousand how much is retail for it retails for 1320 baht which is 36 euros and 41 cents i don't know if in ireland um or in a european country nars concealer costs that much or maybe more but yeah that's how much it costs here in thailand and the next skincare product that I got is, I wanted to try this out actually, this is the Sand and Sky Australian Pink Clay. I don't know if that's going to focus. Yeah, Sky and Sand. And here we go, it's the Australian Pink Clay. I've never tried this, but I really want to try this. So this is the Porifying Face Mask. So it removes impurities, brightens, purifies, blah, blah, and brightens. It purifies and illuminates. So yeah, I've seen this advertised, but on Sephora a lot. I actually want to try it. I got the sample size one. This is actually a sample size one. You know when you go into the counter in Sephora and you walk when you're gonna pay, there's an area where they put like sample size, sample size products in that area. Well, that's where I picked it up. That's a very, very dangerous area for people who basically are looking for to try new things. And yeah, I saw it, I got it, I bought it, and yeah, my money, woo! Uh, this is, let me see, yeah, it's a travel size one. So this costs 1000 and 10 baht which is actually 27 euros and 86 cents which is 33 dollars and 80 cents for a travel size one which is quite expensive i thought it was only around 500 baht half about that but it's okay i already bought it nevertheless yeah let's move on Next products that I've got is hair products. So I've heard a lot of good things about these hair products, this brand of hair product, which is natural hair product. Um, since nowadays I tend to want to try to take care of my scalp a lot, I used to dye my hair a lot, bleach my hair a lot. Um, yeah, and after I I think um, when I did my first video, my hair was not completely black. I don't know. I can't remember. Um, yeah. Uh, after a couple of months before I got back to work, I bleached my hair and dyed my hair to gray and blue and everything like that. So basically, yeah, my scalp is ruined. My hair is ruined. That's why I had to cut it short. <laughs> So I wanted to take care of my hair a bit more since your hair is much more vulnerable now and also my scalp as well. So I wanted to try the Act and Arc Cold Pressed Hair Cleanse and their conditioner. They do, they do give you a mini pump. So I got those two. And basically they both retail for... Uh, 1,100 baht each, which is 30 euros and 35 cents. That's 36 dollars and 81, 82 cents. So yeah, the lady told me that this doesn't actually foam up a lot compared to the other, like, shampoos and stuff. So I'm actually willing to try this possibly tonight. The next two things are perfumes. So, uh, I haven't used any perfume or any body spray in a really, really long time. The only one that I brought is actually from Lush. It's the big 
it's called the, the body spray is called big and I love the scent of that I like to spray it all over my bed because the smell of it kind of makes me calm and relaxed so I wanted to get a perfume that I can actually wear out to work because why not and when I was walking in duty free I came across a perfume and on duty free in King Power, the company that I work in, I went to also buy tea. So basically, I will show you the tea that I got. It's really, really fancy. But I got discount for it because I used my birthday privilege on it. So the perfume that I really like the smell of was from this brand called Narcisco Rodriguez. I guess it's a Spanish brand. And it's called Pure Musk for her. So I got the small size because I didn't want to buy the big size. I got the 30 ml one because I didn't want to buy the... I don't know how big the big one is. I think it's the 60 ml one. In case I actually was mistaken for the smell for the pink one. So there was this white one and there was the pink one that I sprayed on my hand when I was at duty free, right? But I, t I like the white smell better since it didn't smell so strong. So this is the perfume and this is the container of the perfume for 30ml. So yeah. The smell is kind of like a man smell. It's a light, refreshing, not very floral, not very sweet. It's like a man's cologne. And it's very light, which I really like. So this guy retailed for... 3,100 baht, which is 85 euros 50 cents or 103 dollars and 75 cents. So, yeah, for 30 ml. This guy. I didn't want to get the big one because it's also pricey. And I wasn't sure if I actually really like the smell as much or not. But now that I have it and I sprayed it, it's a smell that I actually like. I like. Uh, quite a manly smell it's, yeah it's a manly smell but for a woman you know the next thing that I got is uh, a body spray and it's from Tom Ford so I got the Tom Ford Negroli Portofino all over body spray 150 ml they had the perfume disclaimer of this they had the perfume version of this the perfume version of this was a lot smaller. It's the same size as this guy, 30 ml, but it cost more than the freaking 150 ml body spray. And this body spray, uh, actually wait, that perfume didn't cost the price that I told you. That. This perfume actually cost 2,400 Thai baht, so 66 euros 19 cents or 80 dollars 31 cents. But this guy cost the 3,100 baht, which is 85 euros 49 cents or 50 cents, 103 euro, 103 dollars and 75 dollars. Yes. But the perfume size, which is smaller than this one, cost around uh, 5,400 baht, which is 104, I will say 150 euros to 180 dollars, okay? So I was like, I'm not paying 150 euros or 5,400 baht for a small little perfume. I got the fifth 150 ml what? 
it looks like just like a kind of like a, what you call it a very cheap kind of spray but this smell is the smell this perfume actually this perfume and this smell is the perfume and the smell that I wanted for a really really long time from from Tom Ford like it has been almost probably five years since I've been into the Fort Tom Ford shop in Siam Paragon in Bangkok when I was I came here back here for holidays and I smelled this perfume and I really really wanted but the perfume was really really expensive as for the big one you know so I was like no I won't buy it and so now I got it but yeah I'm very proud of my purchase at Sephora because normally these days I don't really shop at Sephora at all because I find that their products are kind of like pricey really really pricey but I decided to give Sephora a try again and I got some stuff that I really really like so yeah moving on to fashion now we're moving on to fashion finally skincare is done so the first bag I will show you guys is from my favorite shop Aitland so from Aitland what did I get? I got a fabric fabric bag is it called a fabric bag? well it's a bag it's a bag it's a fabric bag and this was on a discount it's from OIOI brand it's a very famous brand in Korea the reason why I got it because it had like a mini pocket on the inside and yeah and it's really really nice this guy basically let me just get everything do I have everything here yes I do so basically this guy retailed for one hundred and ninety baht which is thirty euros and five cents or thirty six dollars and forty five cents I'm into paper bags not paper bags fabric bags these days and I got another fabric bag which says UFO on it and it's also a Korean brand as well and this guy retailed for This guy retailed for how much did it retail for? Eight hundred and fifty baht, which is twenty three euros, and forty three cents, and twenty eight dollars and forty three cents. So yeah. This one is a black one with orange youthful writing on it. And two things, two tops that I got from Alien also. I got a bud case. Normally these are so hard to find for Samsung users, especially when you have a bud. Here in Thailand, everyone use AirPods, Apple, whatever products so I was so happy when I found they had a case they had two cases left white and black so I decided to get the black one because it's less dirty so happy I found this in the sales section so I was very very happy and basically this cost uh -huh. this cost this cost 990 baht Which is 27 euros 30 cents or 33 dollars and 11 cents okay so i'm really really happy that i found this because it's really really hard to get a case for your buds now the last two products that i actually bought is t-shirts so i got this yellow one from the brand called chucks and i got the size l because i like large um large shirts because I find them more comfy 
So this retail for 1290 baht, which is 35 euros 58 cents or $42.14. It is a Korean brand. I like my Koreanness. Yeah. So this is from a brand called Chucks. And the next one is a purple one here. Also in the size L. And most of these are from the men's section because I like men's t-shirts. And this is also in a large. This is a brand called Filuminate. And this cost uh, 1,090 baht, which is 30 euros and 6 cents or 36 dollars and 45 cents. So yeah. So I got two shirts, two bags, one Galaxy Bud case. And then I got a free I got a free bag. So this brand is called an S plus K. So this is a gift bag. So they gave me a gift bag as well. Which is really really cute. And I also got a booklet for coupons that I can use on the next shopping spree. So this lasts until the 28th of February. So this is quite useless for me because I don't think that I'll be shopping again anytime soon before the 28th but yeah also I got an AMP cash voucher which lasts until the 30th of April so this is a keeper but the coupons I don't think so next, next clothing product is Hello Kitty Dad bag. So this is not a brand store. This is like a market that they open in front of Siam Paragon or in alleyways and stuff like that. And I found this really cute t-shirt store. They only do one size, which is probably as large. And yeah, I got four different t-shirts and I really really like it. the quality is very good as well. So the first one I got is also a purple color. And it says, no time for fake people. And the second one is, I got in a kind of like minty green color. Also it says, no time for fake people. Um, then, the next one is a tie-dye one, which has a flower that's smiling on it. And the last one that I got is also a tie dyed one and it says today is a good day. So yeah, so I guess this is where we have to say goodbye for this video. Um, so I hope you guys had a really good Christmas, a really good New Year's, a really good Chinese New Year and a really good Valentine's Day. Um, I hope that even if you and also had a great birthday if you had it if you guys birthdays have already passed like mine so yeah i hope every day is a happy lovely joyful day a good day for everyone um i hope that everyone uh, within <laughs> that have started to have started um the things that you wished to do last year but couldn't and started to do the things this year uh, what else I'm thinking so hard about what to say to you guys because I missed you guys so much I haven't talked to you guys in so such a long time yeah but I hope this year all your dreams all your hard work that you put into your dreams or whatever you want to do um, come true and be accomplished as much as possible this year I know last year has been a really really rough time for everyone and I know this year will also be a rough time but hopefully it will get better and hopefully that um, when it gets better more opportunity for those who actually need the opportunity will come more um, there's a lot of things happening here in Thailand and also in Bangkok as we are also looking for the we are looking for freedom here for the Thai people um, a lot of things are happening 
um, there has been hashtags and everything of what's happening here in Thailand and we hope that this situation and the government will understand and you know we are all waiting for change also here also me here in Thailand um, hopefully that this year will bring a lot more joy than more sorrow a lot less loss and but more gain so yeah I hope you guys have a really good here is night time is 8 p.m. so have a good night day afternoon wherever you guys are and yeah I'll see you guys in the next video Bye.